What's up guys, this is Massey and this video I want to show you how to do integration of 10 to the power of 5x. So I'm gonna use some trig identities and some variable change or substitution to solve this question. So 10 you know is a ratio of sine over cosine so we have sine to the power of 5x divided by cosine to the power of x dx and then for sine to the power of 5 I'm gonna make it sine to the power of 4x times sine to the sine x divided by cosine to the power of x dx then I will separate it and here instead of sine to the power of 4 I can say sine squared and another squared so it's going to be 1 minus cosine squared x to the power of 2 divided by cosine to the power of 5x multiplied by this sine x here dx. So it will be 1 minus cosine squared x squared divided by cosine to the power of 5x sine x dx. Then I will have substitution, so I have variable change, I can say u equals to cosine x, so du will be negative sine x dx. So sine x dx will be negative du. So I just sub it here, it's going to be 1 minus u squared squared divided by u to the power of 5 times du. So I make it like that and I, exp I want to expand this one. It's going to be 1 plus u to the power of 4 minus 2u squared divided by u to the power of 5 and negative here du. Okay, so we have 1 over u to the power of 5 du plus 1 over u because u to the power of 4 divided by u to the power of 5 is going to be 1 over u du minus 2 u squared divided by u to the power of 5 is going to be 2 divided by u to the power of 3 du so the derivative of the first one will be u to the power of negative 4 divided by negative 4. Second one is going to be ln u and this one is going to be negative 2 u to the power of negative 2 divided by negative 2 plus c. So it's going to be if you apply this negative it's going to be 1 over 4 u to the power of negative 4 plus ln u so it's going to be minus ln u. These two cancel out. It's going to be negative 2 divided by 2. And then you will have u to the power of negative 2 plus c. So that's going to be 1 over 4 cosine to the power of 4x minus ln cosine x minus 1 over cosine squared x plus c. So that's going to be the final answer to this question. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And don't forget to subscribe this channel.